Russia's defence ministry released these pictures today of what it says are its forces capturing a village in Ukraine's Mykolaiv region. But Ukraine has long been planning a counter-offensive in the south. And today, regional officials said efforts had begun to retake the southern city of Kherson, which has been under Russian control since the spring. Residents have been told to leave the area, and Russia has already reported heavy Ukrainian losses. Further northeast, close to the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant, rescue workers have been taking part in training on managing the risk of radiation, as fears of a large-scale incident at the plant continue. The US government has urged a complete shutdown of the plant as experts from the International Atomic Energy Agency arrive in Ukraine for an inspection. Director General Rafael Grossi saying safety and security there must be protected. Doctors in the area have begun handing out iodine tablets. It is a preventative measure. One must not take the pill upon receiving it. It must be taken only after an official notification by the authorities. Over 8,000 people have received tablets, including 2,500 children. Both sides have accused each other of damaging the plant. Russia claims Ukrainian shelling punched a hole in the roof of a building used to store reactor fuel at the site, but its installed officials said today that radiation levels there remain normal. Eleanor Burnhill, RTE News.